In this video, for the past 20 days, I only built the most elegant NPC for Monsta, Eula. After over a year since her last rerun, Eula is finally coming back in version 3.8. With every character I built for 20 days in the past, I have some sort of story on why I'm spending 20 days worth of resin for them. For Eula, however, I don't really have one. Listen, I know how to appreciate a character's design, and without a doubt, Eula is one of the prettiest in this game. So, for the next 20 days, I'm gonna spend all of my resin to build the most powerful physical carry you'll ever see. Well, uh, at least try. <laughs> With that said, let's get this shot started, shall we? To start this challenge off, I need to set up what Eula's team will look like. There's a few variations, but for my team, at least for now, I will have Eula, Raiden, Mika, and Bennett. Raiden will trigger Super Conduct and fill in as a second DPS during Eula's downtime. Mika is there temporarily because I'm not really sure if I can get his C6, which buffs physical damage, but we won't really know until we actually, you know, get to pull. And of course, the last one, well, do I really have to explain Bennett? Come on now, it's Bennett. Unless you have C6, then rest in peace. <laughs> as for the starting gear, because I'm pretty much F2P, <clears throat> My weapon of choice will be Serpent Spine. Oh, it's F2P because it's a 4 star, you know? <laughs> no? Alright. For artifacts, I will use a 4 piece Pill Flame or maybe mixing 2 pieces like Pill Flame and Bloodstain. And lastly, I actually need to get Eula because I can't really build Eula without Eula. What am I gonna do if I didn't get her? Build Physical Dory? <laughs> Thankfully, I have the worst luck in the game and got myself a guaranteed. Here's what happened. What is that? Opa. Uh, back. What were we talking about? I kind of forgot. No, we'll do we'll do Sargler. Sargler is like free. I'm just hoping for an early here. If I get if, if I want to see one Kazwa, I I hope for an early. Bro, I guess I can't complain since it was early, but like, quack, man. I pulled a chi -chi. <laughs> On the other hand, at least we know now that we have a guaranteed Eula and the last thing we have to worry about is Eula actually getting a rerun in 3.8. Since I started this challenge 8 days into Kazuo's rerun, it still wasn't officially announced. But I took the risk and started pre-farming. So for day 1, we do what we usually do and prioritize ascension materials. We go back to Dragon Spain and farm the Cryo Cube. It's my first time actually going against the cube, as you can see with the new entry thingy. It wasn't a really big problem though because of my very well built hotel. Oh, speaking of hotel, thank you for 200k reviews in that building hotel video by the way. Really means a lot. Thank you. While waiting for the key to respond, we have yet another difficult task to complete, and that is dandelion seeds. Holy fuck, here we go again. I'm not gonna run this time, I swear. But farming these motherfuckers. Why do we only have like 50 something in our world? Do you expect me to join other people's world and actually have to talk and ask them? Nah, bro, you're asking for way too much now. Anyways, so open up the interactive map and mark the dandelion locations for us to occasionally come back to. Occasionally, because they only respawn like once every two days or something. A few minutes have passed, we did pretty much the same routine. Do the queue while responding, farm dandelion seeds maybe do some chest hunting and repeat for the last one of the day we got a possible off piece for eula it doesn't have crit damage but it does have crit rate and er which eula desperately needs so we'll lock it in for now and uh, that pretty much concludes day one we come back the next day and the first thing we did was to farm ascension materials while waiting yet again for the cube to respawn i went to the nearest crafting table and prepared my healy troll drops for talent and ascension levels i needed about 129 blue drops 96 green ones and 36 gray ones after crafting everything i had to the ones i need i now have over 133 blues 35 greens and one gray i plan to triple crown eula or at least try so i had to prepare every material she needs since we're still lacking a lot of mob drops it was time to farm healy trolls i'm actually farming healy Huh? In between farming, I would check if the cube has to respond and I would just claim my bounty and go back to farming healers. After a few minutes, I went ahead and did my last ascension run for the day and challenged Azdaha. It's been a while since I actually did a weekly so I was hoping for the right drop and some dream solving. After failing to do a 260 no scope with Yalan, finally hit one but I accidentally left the domain since I thought it was the claim button. I I hate myself. Ay, ay, ay. Well, I had to take out my anger in someone. 
right? Since I had to redo the whole thing once again, I brought my big dong damage Ayaka and cleared Azda as quick as possible. It wasn't the right drop and no dream solvent, but at least it dropped two artifacts. Surely one of them is good, right? To end the day off, I leveled up a few Pelflin pieces like the circlet to hopefully get crit damage. I leveled up the sands as well, hopefully for crit rate and... Despite the bad substats, I still continued and got what I wished for. Since I didn't have a lot of artifact XP, I stopped there and called it a night. I stopped a little bit on essential materials for day 3 so I can farm talent books. Today is Friday and my god, we need to farm books. We can't even crown one talent with these amount of books. What the fuck am I supposed to crown free then? The cherry on top, the domain on where to get those books are fucking annoying. Oh thank god I have Shangling to carry me. <laughs> Anyways, I condensed my resin for the day and used all of it on the talent book domain. After using all of my resin, I harvested the remaining dandelion seeds that we marked out. I was so glad I had over 100 plus seeds already or else I would have lost it. Ah, fuck it. We'll do, we'll do, we'll do. Uh, Eula's artifacts today. Why not, right? Yeah, this is why you always go for guaranteed upgrades first. If you want to do this challenge, please focus on your essential materials, levels, talents, and weapons. Don't be like this guy, please. Although, for the first time in almost a year of playing Ninja Impact, I actually explored to achieve an F2P weapon. But the journey of the exploration was interesting, to say the most. I'll just play the clips. Oh. Okay, so there's one more. Where the fuck is that? Yo, chat, help. Okay, let me, let me set this up. Genshin, Snow Tomb, Star Silver, uh, location. It says around here. I don't know which one I collected. You can literally see the symbols? Really? Where? The streamer lost his fucking... <laughs> see, it's right here, right here. This is the one I was missing. I didn't have to look. See? Told you. It's already lit up. I fuck. Okay, chat, 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 chat. Help me out here. Help me out here. Look, look, look. Just look at this. Just look at this. How can I tell which one is lit or not? Because it doesn't show. Am I am I missing something? It just shows like where the location is. So I don't know which one I claimed and which one I haven't. Just do all then. <laughs> oh, there's, there's a sign here. Maybe, maybe this is another quest that no one knows. Oh shit. I have to do adventuring. Oh, I just have to follow it. My God, this is easy, bro. I will have such difficulty doing this. Okay, so let's see how you walk first, yeah? Okay? How about you? How about you? My minions do all of it for me. I get it now. I get it now. Watch, 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 watch. Hi, how are you? Hi, Blia. What the fuck are you doing? So why'd you stop? So wait, so wait, so wait, so wait. Chat, help me out. It's just timing. I get it now. Don't worry about it, chat. I don't get it. <laughs> I think it's after or after it goes there then you put there and then boom boom pow watch you go first go and then you open that you go next boom open that and you go next easy i literally did not ask chat for help watch boom boom and then boom my god dude sometimes my brain scares me sometimes how smart i am really really scares me oh no Wait, how the fuck do you do this? Chat, help me out. Oh, wait, I didn't pick it up. Yeah, I'm not kidding. I'm not kidding. I'm not kidding. The lag is way too crazy. You guys don't understand. Dude, I explored this fucking 11 months ago. Right here. It's below? How the fuck do you go down there? There's a cave entrance at the teleporter to the bottom left. Oh, no. Not that one. <laughs> Which one? Here? Is it? Oh, fuck me now. Found it first try. Exactly. Oh, my God, I'm so good. I already had it. Wait, really? Wait, when did I explore there? First of all, when did I explore there? Wait, which one is this then? It's the one in on top of Star Glow. Oh, maybe I should I should make a I should make a like a tutorial on this. Yo, how to explore with Frapple? Shit. So it says you have to go. Okay, you teleport uh uh in the thing. You teleport here to you said, and you have to go to the platform to the left and climb on the slope. I don't know what that means. Oh fuck! Scared the fuck out of me. Oh wait. How do you break this? Okay, I'm done. After a few minutes, I finally figured out which one was needed. Thanks to my chat for guiding me, I was finally on track of obtaining the weapon. Okay? Alright. You'll you'll be my eyes. Do I go right or left? I'm closing my eyes. Wait, I gotta read. Side the cave here. Okay. Now on the right side, climb up here. 
Africa. I finally reached the destination where the last stone will be, but then this happened. Thanks so much chat for helping me once again. I managed to find the last box in no time. Oh, you get this and then boom. Wow. See chat, told you I don't need help. Wow, opens. Big hole opens. Huh? Shit, man. How damn it's dark in here? Ooh! You got the recipe. Okay, okay. Now, what do you need to craft it? Why? What is this suffering? Why do I only have one? Now, before going straight to the comments, I know what you're thinking. If you lit all the torches inside that room, you will get the snow tome claymore for free without even crafting it. I pretty much wasted a lot of time and effort collecting all of the materials. Why do I never do my research? Well, at least for day five, you don't have to watch the painful experience of me collecting all of those star silver. I'm sure you guys have suffered enough watching me explore. I got the weapon anyways, only after a few minutes, so it wasn't that bad. After doing my dailies, I decided to level up the weapon as far as I can. Thankfully, I had a lot of bucks for the weapon, so I didn't have to use my resin. At the end of the leveling session, I only needed one more ascension for it to be maxed out. Since it's Sunday today, I condensed my resin and went straight to the weapon domain. I got enough to make 3 out of 4 and just had to depend on Ayaka to get a bonus gold one, but... Bruh. I came back a few hours later and I went straight ahead to do the weapon domain. I got a big drop for only 20 resin, so it was enough to get one more gold one. But when I crafted it up, I got this. Bruh. Ayaka, I love you. But what the fuck, man? I burned 2,000 resin on you in a single day. And 20 days of building you afterwards. Why do you hate me? Well, at least we now have a maxed out weapon only in day 5. For the remaining resin, I used it on the town book domain since it was also open and I needed a lot of books. Damn, I love Sunday's invention. It was another big day for day 6 because the Lee Line events are back. Cause goddamn, I need them badly. I used a lot on a previous challenge that will be uploaded. Um... Hopefully soon, yeah? <laughs> so for the first part of day six, I used all of the three claims. After I did Lee Lines, I challenged Azdaha once again, but I didn't get the right drop nor a dream solvent. For the second part, I used all my resin and continued on the essential materials. After today's run, we now have 24 drops out of 46. For the next few days, this is what the daily routine looked like. The Lee Lines event into essential materials and a little bit of dandelion farming. So while we farm, I'll take this opportunity to ask you guys to subscribe if you are enjoying your watch. This type of video takes a lot of time making from literally 20 days of preparation plus the scripting and the editing. So if you can do me a favor, like the video and also comment the characters I should build next. Preferably 4 star DPSs if you have any in mind. I'm trying to hit 10k subs at the end of the year, so supporting the channel in any means will help me out a lot. After days of resin just being spent into essential materials and XP books, day 10 was here and we just need a few more. Not only for essential materials but for the dandelion seeds as well. So for the first part of the day, I focused my resin on the last few essential materials and farming dandelions during downtime. And just like that, we now have exactly 46 crystalline blooms and 169 dandelion seeds. Afterwards, I had more resin to play with, so I finished the daily Lee Lines event and used the remaining resin for more town books. For day 11 and 12, I just used my resin for the last few days of the Leland's event and just condensed the rest and saved it for a big artifact run at day 13. So at the end of day 12, and pretty much doing the Leland's event every day, I had a lot of books stored plus the 5 condensed resin for a big day tomorrow. Okay, this is not looking good. Bruh. Dude, I'm only getting the other piece. What is this? Oh, man, this is why I don't like fucking artifact farming, bro. Let's use this as well. Boom. Get all the fragile resin, baby. Last five condensed and then we're out of content. <laughs> Come on, at least one artifact today. Bruh. Physical damage bonus on my one and only goblet. Psych! <laughs> bro! At least one piece. We don't get anything. You know, you can't. You can't. You, you can't be serious right now. No way. Where's the pale flames at, bro? What is this? We have 10 condensed resin today. How many pale flames did we get? Fucking zero. I guess we'll level up some of the pieces. Okay, let's level this up because I want this. I want everything to go to crit damage because that would help out with my damage a lot. Of course, he got HP. Her damage. Ay. 
Well, that huge artifact session didn't really go as planned, huh? With no more resin to use, we do have another option. Strongbox and Chivalry. I know it's Copian, but why the fuck isn't Pelflame in the Strongbox yet? Who even uses four-piece bloodstain? Just kidding, that domain is even worse than collecting dandelions. Alright, maybe we'll get some good luck on this one. Nope. Maybe. <sighs> Wait a minute. Watch this. Okay, that's not starting well. It's fine, it's fine. Watch this, good rate. <laughs> no, wait a minute. Wait, wait, no, wait a minute. Okay, hold on, hold on. God damn! Yo! <laughs> what the fuck? I mean, it's fine. It's fine. At, at least it's a tag. Okay, this will be like a perfect situation, I feel like. If I get like an off-piece goblet for Pale Flame, I would still be able to run four-piece Pale Flame and then like the off-piece circle. Because this circle is way too good. I'm not getting rid of that. I guess that's it for the YouTube recording. Bye. Four nine nine more subs for made cosplay. I'm not doing a fucking maid cosplay, bro. Day 14 has arrived and Eula is finally on the banner. But since it was super late for me, I saved the wishing and condensed my resin for tomorrow. You guys know the, the strategy. When I'm desperate for a character, you guys already know. You come home early. Dude, surely 70 pulls is enough, right? 50 pity with 20 pulls. Well, 20 F2P pulls today, by the way. Bring out the, the Eula team and then sacrifice Dory into it. It's time. Let's get an early. <laughs> Boom! Early Eula, please! Mika cons would be nice. Uh, we got a young Razori. Oh, double? Okay, actually, I need her to come home in this pool. I'm at 60 pity right now. It is a guaranteed, but I really need her to come here. I don't want to spend anymore, please. You look, come home. I've been pre-farming. Ay! <laughs> Mika of the Knights of Favonius. Young Razore, okay. <laughs> it's literally the same multi. Okay, come on, come on. I actually need it here. I actually need it here. I don't want to spend. Please, please. I don't want to swipe. Please. You look, come home. Come on. I've been the biggest Eula advocate ever. Ay, puta. Wait, wait, we're doing a best. We're doing a best. I'm not swiping today. Is that one way? Please, 74 pity. Ay. Mika? Bruh. Ay. Eula. I'm home. Please, I don't want to spend. Nope. Rolls it forever, motherfucker. Let it go. Let it go. Ah! Bridge. You look, I'm home. Yes. My God. Yes. I didn't have to rail today. <laughs> you love. I get her. Damn! Sorry, I... After acquiring Eula, it was time to level her up all the way to max ascension. I leveled up the talents as well to a decent 646 line. At this moment, it was clear that triple crowning her is pretty much impossible, kinda like how impossible it is for us to get endgame content. I could've tried, but I had limited days, and seeing how my stats aren't even close to being good, as well as my artifacts being underleveled, I had no choice but to save this challenge with some gamba. I had over 10 condensed resin for this stream. Surely, we at least get an upgrade, right? Watch this, fam. This is literally the perfect pill frame artifact, fam. Ooh! We have two chances here. Hydro? Oh, fuck. Ah, oh, fuck. Two chances. Fiscal Goblet. Great rate. Aye! What the fuck? Psych! Okay, come on. Big reveal. Are we fucking melting with Eula? What is all this shit? And if that's a physical Goblet, it works. Come on. Please. Please. I probably have the worst luck in the game. Well, thanks to the strong boxes, we have another chance to get a decent 2 piece chivalry. Or will we? Okay. Okay. Oh! Fuck. It's fine. It's fine. Everyone needs HP. Hey! That's good. That's good. Hi, <laughs> Putin. What the fuck? I mean, it's 
okay. It's fine. It's fine. It's usable. All right. We're coping because I don't have a single fucking good piece, man. Right, the final stats. Okay. I have to change this somehow. I have to change this to a, to a crit rate circuit, but this is like our nuke damage, right? For the abyss, maybe we'll do like a crit rate one if I can find one. But yeah, we have five more days in this challenge to prepare for Eula. But as of right now, as of day 15, this is our kind of shit stats. Low, very low ER. Good amount of crit damage. Crit rate's kind of balls. Attack is, it's so bad. Since yesterday was another unlucky artifact day, I decided to go for more talent levels to kind of save the situation. But since the domain was closed today, I can that's my resin today for a big run tomorrow. When day 17 arrived, I quickly went to the talent book domains and literally used all of my save resin from yesterday. At the end of today's run, I leveled up the elemental skill to level 6, elemental burst to level 8, and the normal attack to level 7. On the next day, the talent book's domains are closed, so that means there's only one thing we could do. But this time, the situation was different. Oi, yo, bye, yo, okay, surely, yo. Oh, that's not bad. Now our stats are... The rest of the runs were kind of ball, so I just leveled up a few pieces that had potential, and this happened. I believe. <laughs> nah, nah, just kidding. Watch this god piece. Please. Ooh. Okay, crit damage is it's good. Okay, wait. This time, actual good piece. Trust. Crit damage. <laughs> please, please, game, please, game. I literally will right now if this uh, if this is at least a, a thirty-five CV piece. Okay, wait. Hold on. I hate this game so much. I fucking... Well, honestly, with all the bad luck from the previous days, day 18 was still a W. The second to the last day was the last chance for talent books, so I used every resin I had on the domain. I then crafted them up to the purple ones and upgraded my ult to level 9. It's truly unfortunate that I can't even crown one talent and I only managed to get 7, 6, 9. Well, it is what it is. However, everything came down to the last day. With every challenge I did, I at least willed a little bit for that character, either getting their signature weapon or pulling constellations for them. For Eula, I didn't really do that much. So for today, I used this week's transient resin plus 3 fragile resin from my collection. So I'll link to another 10 condensed resin run. I really need a better flower or a better goblet. Will we get an upgrade today? Or will the stats stay the same? Honestly, if we don't somehow downgrade, everything should be fine. <laughs> right? Oh, okay. Double attack, crit rate, crit damage, ER. <laughs> we need a crit rate circle here. Would be nice. Crit damage would be nice too. Oh, triple drop. Bruh. Triple shit. <laughs> it's another triple drop, bro. What the fuck? Hey, that's decent for, for my Nilu. That's also decent for my Nilu. This, this has potential. Dude, how is it so hard to get fucking flower in this shit, man? This is my worst pieces of flower. Okay, I'm not complaining. Oh, possible. Ah. Ah, what the fuck? And just like that, all of my resin was gone. At this point, I could have coped and rolled some potential pieces, but then I remember I didn't really treat Eula that well. So I brought out the big guns. Okay, okay, chat. I have an idea. Since I didn't really spend much on Eula, we will do uh we will do we will do something for her, alright? Um how much is Oh wait, let me check my bank account real quick. Whoa, whoa, what is this shit, man? Yo, yo, thank you for the donation, whoever did it. I, I appreciate you. Uh, but yeah. Alright, I have to pee. Close your eyes. You have five seconds to, to close it, alright? Oh! Oh, no, no, no. Alright, I gotta stop. Oh, fuck. Uh, yo, thank you so much for the 362 resin donation. You are so kind. Goddamn. Bruh. Dude, why is it always in the wrong fucking piece? getting the defense ones on a physical damage one and we're getting the critters one on the fucking hp one what the fuck oh wait double drop right here surely right physical damage goblet attack <laughs> if this is physical i'm gonna cry <laughs>
Let's what go grab is it. that? Fuck. Even after fully refreshing, I didn't get a single good piece. I rerolled a few artifacts as all, well, hoping to get some good substats, but I think you already know what happened. Literally, the only piece that could save Mayula was this decent goblet with crit rate and ER. If everything only went to those two stats, it will kinda balance and save my build. Will it live to its expectations, or will this be the downgrade of a lifetime? First roll should go to crit rate. Ah, uh, fuck, do I go all in? If I go all in and everything goes to like this she at least higher than like what I have right now. What I have right now is this one. Do I risk it, chat? I think this requires a bit of context. Only reason why I wanted to feed my current goblet is because I ran out of Arpha XP while re-rolling a lot of sets and pretty much going all in for this mid feather. We're actually melting with Jula. This was practically my last chance to see the situation, but then this happened. This is a very, very big gamba, but I'm doing it. I believe in the frapple luck. Watch. Watch. And that pretty much concludes how I built Eula in 20 days. She's now level 81 with an R2 Snow Tome. She's on a 2-piece Chivalry and a 2-piece Spell Flame. Here are the final artifact stats. She's only C0 for now, and her talents are 7, 6, 9. This is the final stats. And that's pretty much the end of the 20 days challenge. I think I could do more damage if I actually level up my Mona's talents or did my rotation properly, but I honestly do not know how to showcase stuff and I never really liked it. But since it is needed, uh, I had to at least try my best, you know? So hopefully uh, it's good enough. <laughs> My Eula barely crits, so I literally had so many retries, and yeah, I just kind of give up going for more. With very shit artifacts, I think my Eula does okay damage, to say the least, but yeah, I'll be improving her over time, so uh, Eula means, <laughs> I'm sorry for now, <laughs> give me more time. Thanks so much for watching. I appreciate all the support lately. To think I've only had like 100 subs the start of this year, now I'm at like 5k, halfway through 10k. <laughs> Life is crazy right now, not gonna lie. So uh, if you're still here and haven't liked or subscribed yet, might as well, right? It's free and uh, it makes your boy happy. Thanks so much again for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.